Welcome back to another episode of This Is Us Looking at the Eye of the Destroyer and Soraya at the same time ish, actually. Yes. <laughs> now, uh, we are going to figure out what these four commandments of the Gizong are all about. And we are, of course, ready to do whatever we have to do. Haha. <laughs> uh, raring to go. That's what I like to see. Then let's begin our readings of Gizong's four commandments. To each with wisdom, be bound by virtue, fortify the bones, unite in ambition. The convergence of these four shall be known as the Gili Assembly. On the surface, it does read like a set of commandments, golden rules for life, but it's also supposed to contain some sort of clues to a hidden treasure. I can't decipher it though. It seems we'll have to approach this in what academics like to call the old fashioned way. These seven passages we found previously, they were all located in ruins of some sort. Since uh, we are not sure where to start this time, perhaps keep searching in ruins for now. Um, yeah, where exactly? Um, yeah, for now let's limit the search area to Gili Plains. <laughs> However, as I am just a scholar, there's no way I'd be able to keep up with you out in the field, so I will leave the actual ruin searching for you. Just let me know what you find. While we are on the subject, I once came across a strange plate with some writing on it. Uh, one of the ruins around here. I only looked at it in isolation though. Didn't do any sort of holistic analysis. Now I think about it. It might be connected to Gizong's four commandments. How am I? How about I mark the location on your map? You should go check it out. Maybe I'll lead somewhere. It'll the aisle. So wait a minute. Uh, there. Enter the ruin and search for the strange jade light. I think I know exactly what we're looking for, but okay. Does this marker coincide with? A rock plate ring, uh, or in this case, it's one of those uh, strange plates that I have found. Where is this? Yeah, the rock plate ring is this one. Um, I think, yeah, there's a little construct on top of that, and this is what this marker thingy is all about. Hmm. Strange plate. I actually have to rename this uh, from rock plate ring to strange plate. Just in case. Uh, yeah, to take this one here. Let's change its name uh, into strange plate. Uh, strange plate. Enter. Alright. So, do we... Uh, Okay, scanning or doing anything else doesn't do anything. And we have to start. Uh, to unite an ambition is to be steadfast and immovable for all. This looks like the kind of place that I was hoping for. And we found a clue. Hmm. If he's right, there should be three more of these around here. Three more around here. Me, bay, me, bay. Uh, no, two. Hmm. That's interesting. Uh, the strange plate quest. Uh. Oh wait a no wait a minute. Yeah, there's another strange plate. Chest ruin. Hmm. And that could be the last strange plate. That's like one, two. Uh, I think I have to fi uh, figure out what this area is all about. And then I ha also have to figure out what a this the uh this is uh enter the ruin and search for the strange shade plate wait 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 enter the ruin <coughs> is there a uh a door thingy that opened up for me or what happened investigate to unite an ambition is to be steadfast and immovable for all time Steadfast and immovable. Meaning, uh, yeah, that you are not moving, but why? Ooh. Why is it that you should not move? Strange, strange, strange. Mm, I am looking for stone plated ring thingy. That's weird. Look at that. 
Uh, there's no energy that shows me the way, so I'm a bit confused. Uh, this way, maybe. Because there is another ruin somewhere around here. Uh, it's right there. Uh, oh, let's get some horse tail. There we go. Ooh, nah. No chest. Alright, let's check out this one here because I'm kind of curious. Oh, wait a minute. Alright. Not what I want to do. Come on. Yeah, nice. Alright, let's do another one. I always think that he is attacking the closest <laughs> enemy possible, but if you use a uh, an aimed ability like the uh, stone flower, it's not always the case. This is not one of those. Okay, they're supposed to be into the ruin and search for a strange place. Wait a minute. Um. Hmm. Enter the ruin. With Enter the Ruin, I actually thought oh, that the there's a, um, like an entrance, really, uh, that opened up because I heard a, a gate opening. Uh, there's another one here. Uh, let's see what this is. This mechanism won't uh, activate. Maybe it takes some sort of special approach. You yeah, may be. Uh, hmm. That's not the one. Enter the ruin. And search for a strange jade plate. Oh my, it's really <sighs> ah, that's annoying. Okay, mark the plates already. It's just that... I'm not quite sure if this is the one. Okay, stood there, steadfast, whatever, uh, and then there's supposed to be things opening up, and as a result of this, more stuff is supposed to happen, so, hmm. Oh no, I have to be careful not to draw in here. That's one reason why you should always play with a large character, so you don't go into the swimming motion. <laughs> Alright, like my guess is that there is some kind of gate somewhere, because I I, I heard a uh, a mechanism opening, whatever. Oh wait, large ones, perfect. <laughs> nice, we got a heavy horn. Ah, really? <laughs> Why is it that I cannot destroy? Oh! I got the dude already, that's perfect. 3, 2, oh no. <laughs> Look at this. I just aimed between them and for some reason I just took it. I'm so bad that I'm good. Uh, it's essential what it is. Three, two, one, bam. It's kind of full circle, really. Damn. Uh, that's not working. Yeah, nice. So, um, hmm. These enemies, though, are not the ones I need to concern myself with. Uh, I don't know if I was on top of that little hill before. Just want to check. Yeah, I think I was. 
but just for clarity. No, there's, uh, there's nothing there. Mm, this is the ruin. It just says enter the ruin, but it does not... Maybe it's behind the marker. If I get rid of this thing, uh, it will actually show me the marker for that. Um, hmm. Yeah, I think I have to find the entrance to this specific ruin here. Because it could be uh, understood that this is the ruin, or uh, the whole thing, like the whole Gilly Plains are the ruin. Uh, I just don't know how large that ruin is. And I'm, that could be an entrance. That's definitely an entrance. There's the entrance. I think I found it. Okay. Uh, that looks to me like an entrance. Uh, maybe let's attack it. Um, no, nah, that's not it. Um, if I wouldn't know it any better, I would say this is an entrance. Like it, uh, compared to all the other stone formations, that one looks specific. Really strange. Um, hmm. Investigate. Oh, maybe I have to put something on it. Let's see. Hmm. Hey. Uh, nope. I think I bucked out this quest. Because it said start, didn't it? Uh, I clicked on it and it said start. And then it told me to go into the ruin. Uh, but is it this ruin? Or is this whole thing the ruin? What I mean is like the that whole thing here is one huge ruin or... Are these multiple ruins? But then, where is the bloody entry? Where, where is the gate uh, that got triggered? Where is the thing? I was moving about. Ah, uh, that's not it. Hmm. According to Zoraya, the strange shape played in the ruins may hold more clues. <sighs> the strange jade played in the ruins. The gem. <sighs> to unite an ambition is to be steadfast and immovable for all time. Okay. Hmm. I hope that this has nothing to do with just standing still also. I think that's not the one. Come on. Nah, nothing works. I don't know. <sighs> For all time. It's a rock. I don't want to switch to another character. Okay. Let's just switch to another character. Maybe I have to get the main character for this. Uh, I'm not quite sure though. Let's go to the main character. Uh, there we go. Ah, oh, sh shit. Okay, I can't do that. Mm, the main character is animal aligned. That's not working. <sighs> Steadfast and immovable for all time. Yeah, goodness gracious. What the hell? This looks like a face to me. Uh, there's also no hole or anything where you could just uh, fall through. It's just that... Uh, the 
area down there, especially like Um, was it? Oh, wait, what? Yeah, especially down there. This is, um... I don't know why it's not working. <gasps> hmm. I think the wording is incorrect. Um, I think it's supposed to say ruins instead of ruin singular. Um... Hmm. The problem is just that... Okay, maybe the one in the center... Uh, like, this one here is the last one. And I have to just get towards the other <coughs> markers first. Let's go to the one in the east. It's just strange hearing this mechanism and not seeing anything happen. It's not... Yeah, you just hear something move, right? Um, but you don't know where this movement is going to. You just hear like a chain rattling or like a heavy stone-ish moving thingamajig. But that is it. So yeah, wait a minute. Uh, what's up there? No, bollocks. <laughs> uh, I think this was the animal mill, wasn't it? No, it's not. That could be the one. Yeah, start. Ah, okay. Wisdom is like water. It nourishes all those who receive it and... Whatever. Uh, I got another thing. I could read that. So, it go... I think we have to go around this thing here. Uh, and then we have to end up... In the centermost area. Come on. There we go. I need... Two more. Uh, there is. Uh, there's a CD over there. There's a strange plate here. And then there's a strange plate here. Let's go south even further. Uh, this one looks like it. Huh. That's the only one with an actual gate nearby. The gate has nothing to do with it, does it? Yeah, fortify the bones, the movement by supply when the time comes, and so on and so forth. And this was... Yeah, what well, was this one all about? I think there was a totem... Ah, no, there's something different here. And the other strange plate is over there. Just have to go further north. Thank goodness I marked those things, otherwise it would have been so annoying. Preparation. Okay, now I got all four of them. Now it's time to go back to Zaraya. And as usual, uh, we're not going to read uh, <laughs> the text. When we finish Soraya's mission, uh, I actually want to know what's written on this thing here. A clue found in the northern Gilly Plains ruins. Uh, to unite in ambition is to be steadfast and immovable for all time. Uh, a clue found in the eastern Gilly Plain ruins. Wisdom is like water. It nourishes all those who receive it and in it is a reflection of the truth. A clue found in the southern Gilly Plains. Uh, fortify the bones that movement... Bones. That movement be subtle, supple when the time comes. A clue found in the western Gilly Plain ruins. Virtue goes tall like trees. Though there be shade, it will flourish forever. Sometimes fate is inescapable, even for a god. I found four clues and four ruins. Four ruins, four clues. And there are four commandments. What a coincidence. It, yeah, ruins, plural. That's why I was kind of confused, because it says look for or enter. No. Look for a tablet. A jade tablet. Um, in the ruin, singular. But they are ruins. More than one. Each of these clues uh, expands upon the meaning of one of the four commandments. To get to the correct interpretation, the original text of Gizong's four commandments is key. 
These four are hopeful, but peripheral to our inquiry. These five passages are all linked, but how? Convergence? What? Uh, I mean that these four things all link up in some way. Well, I think I know where this thing is going to. Wait, I remember. Each of Kizong's four commandments can be found in a specific ruin. Hmm, I'm speculating here, but perhaps the four ruins are relevant to deciphering the true meaning in Kizong's four commandments. How exactly? I don't know. I need to mull it over. Maybe you could have to uh, think too, or better still, go and investigate it first hand. I'm just a skinny little scholar after all. I tire out completely after a few seconds on the run. Wish I had your stamina. Anyway, I'm going to keep thinking about it for a while, if you think of anything, or if you find anything, you know where I am. Well... Find the final ruin. It's not about finding the final ruin, it's about, um, yeah, it's here, really. Uh, wait a minute. I would say that it has to make a, some kind of cross mark, right? So this is the northern one, and this is the southern. No, this is not one. This is the northern one, this is the southern one, and this is the eastern one here, uh, and this is the western one. So if you put a cross in this one, it kind of crosses over here, roughly. It's not perfectly centered, I would say. Um... Or at least my marks are not perfectly centered, who knows. But it, this is where the four east, west, north, south thingies cross. So let's start this thing, that must be the one. Yeah, start the clue mechanism. Oi. Uh, and I, in my greatest wisdom, did actually increase the world level just to make it more annoying for myself. There. Okay, I have to be careful. Um, food. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. I remembered that I ooh, have this NRE pouch or something. Come on, move, 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 move. Oh, uh. Does this thing actually drop items for me? Of course not. Mm -hmm. And of course, this thing has to stand there and not do a shit. Uh, nope. This one has to use the ulti. There we go. No, 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 no. And it's dead. Perfect. Does it drop stuff? Uh, energy, that's it. That's the last one. Don't run away from me, Jesus. Ooh. Wait a minute, three, two, one, whoop. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah, yeah. Not even a single drop from them, like, chaos devices might be highly appreciated. Now... I can trigger this thing again. Well, we got a chest. Nice. Treasure is always welcome. Oh, Not just one treasure, but more than one treasure. Lucky dogs, whatever. Uh, some other stuff. And it doesn't really depend on what world level you have. Like, the items in here are always the same. Um, it just depends on the rarity of the chest. Uh, what kind of stuff you get. Alright. Now that I opened all the chests, got all the items, I can go back to Soraya. Too bad, or maybe even too good she wasn't there, because now we have all the treasure for ourselves. <laughs> How is the search going? Found the treasure yet? Yes, it was about where they converge, after all. 
really. So it's just like Yizung's Four Commandments says. Uh, the treasure was located at the convergence of these four. Whoever designed this riddle must have truly revered Gizong. So much so that they pres yeah, preserved Gizong's Four Commandments for future generations, even though the Gili Assembly was wiped out. And as for Gizong herself, who established the commandments, she must have been a adored by her people. Clearly she wished for her people to be wise, to hold themselves to a moral code, to be strong and healthy and to find solidarity in the shared enterprise of protecting their home and Gilly Assembly. Oh, the Gilly Assembly. Hmm, but she failed. Well, yeah, kind of. Or the people just moved on and uh, left the ruins as they were. Seems like a gentle natured god, kind of. Uh, I'm not sure gentle natured is a particularly common trait of gods, but maybe it was once, maybe a long, long time ago, among the gods who led the people of the world, there were those gentle by nature, those who protected their people or walked among them, stood by them as they went forth into the world. But it was the gentle gods who were ultimately powerless to protect their people. Look at Gizong. It took an elaborate treasure hunt just to preserve the four commandments that once were the lifeblood of a whole civilization. Well, to me at least, it's clear that the commandments are the real treasure here. A chest full of gold or gems can't compare. But if you made people choose, how many would really pick a list of commandments over material wealth? Well... Interview with a bygone god. It's actually really interesting. Who would really choose that? Oh, you get a Liu shrine. Oh, yes, wait a minute. I have to uh, open some shrines in Liu too. Hmm. It's interesting, right? Um, it's kind of, uh, kind of like the whole uh, teach a man or like give a man a fish and they you feed him for a day. Give him a... Uh, uh, teach him the fish and uh, they survive for a lifetime or like you yeah you feed them for a lifetime um, same for this right uh, teach the, teach them how to collaborate and uh, they can achieve great things uh, teach them the art of war and they destroy themselves it's kind of like that and this is exactly what happened here the warriors took over and as always ruins are the only things that remain it's kind of sad, really. <laughs> Maybe that is uh, one of those lessons of history, right? Everywhere you go, you always see ruins. You, you, you always see ruins where there are no people um, living there anymore. It's kind of strange, right? Because if people would live there, then they would build houses on top of those ruins or they would at least live in the ruins. But you... Yeah, every time you see ruins, they're always somewhere in the sand, somewhere deep in the jungle, forgotten, something like that. How is it that people just forget ruins existed? Or like, that there's a building there, right? As if it's just those people uh, that ever used that ruin. It's like forgetting that there's a town. Kind of. Today, of course, you can't really forget that there's a town because everything is recorded, but... Back in the day, come on. You have to wipe out a whole town for this to happen. I think this is what happened there. This is why there are so many ruins. Because uh, people just wiped out com like complete areas, right? And made everyone in there forget. And then they, uh, instead of just settling there and uh, taking over the farmland or whatever, they just continued towards a certain uh, point like a uh, swarm of locusts really they just eat up what's there until there's nothing left just desert and then uh, yeah they just die off because there's no more food it's kind of like that greed that's the problem with greed greed gives you ruins because otherwise people would still live there at least this is what I would Mm, okay, maybe greed, um, or actually, yeah, destruction, whatever. Depending on what is the uh, actual um, source of the death of the people. It could be disease, but in order for disease to come in, right, an awful lot of different people have to come in there with diseases. Uh, uh, with diseases that you have, uh, where you have no immunity against. 
Hmm. Interesting thought. And the reason why people would go somewhere is to go for, yeah, to get something from there, right? Like, the, 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 you don't go somewhere just to go there. You usually want something from it, whatever. Like, you go to the kitchen because there's the fridge. <laughs> you don't go to the kitchen just to look at the kitchen. <sighs> That's actually really interesting. Yeah, everywhere you go, there's always a purpose behind it. No matter what. Sometimes it's interest. But rarely, it's interesting. <laughs> um, Alright, now, um, what is it I wanted to do next? Uh, I could get rid of this strange plate thingy. Uh, number one. Number two. This is the animal mill. Wait a minute. Uh, it's the strange plate. Strange plate as well. And this strange plate too. Oh, four markers at once. I'm so good. Look at this. Much better. Um. Oh. Oh, come on, you don't even need to mark this. Look at this. See that? There's a ruin here. Like, there's a little rectangular thing with a circle. 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 <laughs> I can zoom in there to see that much more clearly. See that? Bam, 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 bam. It's just that the map is not as sharp if you get too close. You have to zoom a little bit further out. It's a fairly low texture. Anyway. Um, what is it uh, that I wanted to do next? Do some animal thingies. Like, there's one animal mill over here, another one over there. This is a que Oh, no, wait a minute. Delete. This was her quest. This is another CD. Sweet. Six markers. Gone. Ha! <laughs> nice. Um, I wanted to do something else. I just forgot what it was. Uh, she said something about ruins, going for treasure. Oh, Liu keys, yes. Um, there is a salt seal. No, that's not the one. Uh, there's a trine or L. Okay, wait a minute. I have to look at my inventory, what kind of keys I have. Like, it could be huh, Liu keys, of course. Uh, do I have a Liu altar somewhere? This one says chest, ruin, uh, mountain secret, chest, um, animal mill, island, Liuki. Ah, there we go, Liuki. Ah, I think I know exactly what it is. It's the Liuki that was on an island, which is a little bit further away, so I have to figure that out. Anyway, let's get there. Oh, wait, there's a Sisson Mage. 60 as well. I don't need his items. Ah, uh, not like that. There we go. Bam. Come on, lift me upwards. Perfect. Oh. The characters always want to finish their sentences, but I always switch between them. Kind of sad. And we did not get the thing that they are supposed to get me. Um, which is this uh, needle, injection needle thingy. Where was it? North. There's a northern island. Where was this thing? Maybe over there? Uh, no, Southern Island. Southwest. Exactly where I'm looking, this way. Where is this Liu thingy? Oh. Ah. Like, if you aim uh, and shoot fast enough, you can get at least two of those cranes. There's another one. Oh. If you aim it too fast, mm hmm. Hey, there are more. Yeah, at least two. Uh, didn't I? That's weird. Hmm, strange. Ah. 
Ah, always use the drop down if you don't have a Claymore character, just in case. Ooh. Number two. As long as there's a difference in height there, just a minimal one, right? Uh, you can do the jump. As long as it's not the same plane. It will work. Where's this thing? Uh, oh! Uh, why are those thingies back here again? Three of them, even. Oh. Oh my. Oh, that is perfect. I ah, know. No. I pressed the wrong bloody button. Uh, sometimes I want to press uh, jump to evade, but I'm free to one. There's the. Ooh. Oh no 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 <laughs> Oh no 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 Come on that's cheating that's cheating that's cheating No don't <laughs> How are you supposed to get out of there? Three of them using the spin and There should be a safeguard for that just Look at this it's actually possible to uh, evade those rockets. Yeah. But not if you have no stamina anymore. Hmm. Oh no, this one is immune. What the? There's a fourth one. I'm so stupid, I'm so stupid, I'm so stupid. Uh... Yeah. Oh, 3, 2, 1. Come on. Mm. Oh, oh, I don't know. I need something that improves my stamina regeneration. Holy shit. Oh. 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 Okay, I think I know how to evade those thingies again. No, no, no. no. That's just cheating. Oh, that is just... <laughs> you want to evade, but you can't do the second evade because there's no stamina and immediately you get killed like that. Holy crap. I need to dish out much more damage. Not again, not again, not again. Oh. Ah. Okay, I have to take out this one first. Oh no, not again. 3, 2, 1. Uh. Oh. oh. Come on. No, no, no. Of course I'm dying in the water. <laughs> Jesus Christ, look at this. And the fact that they have a uh, ranged attack. Ah, oh, shit, no, 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 no. No, no. Mm. Oh, <laughs> Somehow that difficulty just increased <laughs> tenfold or something. I don't know. It's weird. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I want every game from now on to have an override on activity. That would be sweet. So depending on, like, yeah, yeah, no matter what you do, right, the last action is always the most recent, or should be the one that is, uh, ah, oh, no, no, no. So if you, uh, want to do an evasion, whoop. oh, come on. Why are those thingies? <laughs> And sometimes you can uh, kind of pull them no, no, no. oh. oh shit 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 oh, I don't even dish out that much damage Ooh. 
Okay, I could hide behind like a wall or something. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> holy holy shit. Shit. Oh, this is just a pain. It's an absolute pain. Ah. And again. <laughs> uh. The thing is that those rockets can just do a 90 degree turn. Feel so oh, not again. Okay, now I can finally uh, resurrect her. Oh, uh, this one. Oh my god. Uh. Yeah, nice, 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 it worked. Oh, no, 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 no. They... Oh, come on. Like, at some point, they should just stop. Okay. Hit one, hit two, three, jump, and... Okay, they're already <laughs> gone. Let's do this. Too much damage. Ooh. Okay. What about his stomach? Uh, it's getting. At some point he has to pew. Oh no 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 no! It does it yet again? Look at this! 90 degree turns. That is not possible. Not with backwards propulsion like that. There should be some logical uh thing. Look at this. There should be at least some normal reason here. Look, see that? Uh, it only works if you are like really, really far away. Oh shit. Oh, no. No, no, no. Mm, not again. It's too much bloody damage. Damn, be kidding me. Okay, we got the second one. That's the pay. Uh, I think their behavior changed too. They're not just getting more difficult. Like, dishing out bad dam uh, more damage. They're also, like... Much more painful to deal with. Holy shit. Oh, no. mm -hmm. oh. And once they do this, like, turn around move, like this one here, there should be some. Actually, yeah, friendly fire move going on. Like, uh, if two of them do this move at the same time, they should shred themselves instead. <laughs> that would be cool. A nice way to fight multiple of those uh, ruined guards at the same time. Oh, oh, come on. And they continue after the freeze. At least stop the freeze, man. Come on. Come on. Come Oh. Goodness gracious. It took forever. <laughs> Usually I can defeat them like in a few seconds, but somehow this happens. It's not even that many items that you get, like one chaos to it. I defeated four of them, right? Uh, I don't think. No, if I actually picked up the first bunch of items there. Oh, wait a minute. Um, <laughs> I should mark this spot as a farming spot for um, ruin guards. Um, <laughs> plural. <laughs> uh, okay, amber. Wait a minute. No. Yeah. Uh, let's resurrect her with one of those. <laughs> the amount of food that was used to res <laughs> No, absolutely no. Unbloody believable. Alright, uh, and I can get there if I... Look at that. I forgot to take a geo sigil with me. Uh, 
Uh, uh huh. Yeah. Hmm. That's interesting. I actually thought that those uh, ruin guards were part of a mission or something, and they would not come back. Okay, I have to check out this uh, ring there as well. I think I just can't see it at the moment. Oh, wait a minute. Right there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's stupid. Oh, oh. Slow and steady wins. Actually, no. I think slow and steady does not win the race. Slow and steady gets myself killed. Again. Okay. A lesson for the future. If there's a body of water between you and a target, make sure that whatever you want to do <laughs> at your targeted destination, you can do beforehand. <laughs> so get some keys just to make sure. Uh, Alright, that should be it. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. <laughs> Ah, and I only need one of those keys, that's perfect. And in here we have, and... Draw meat, exiles, feather, lucky dog stuff, mysterious stuff, some guides, whatnot. Decent-ish items, but that is it. Nothing out of the ordinary. I was looking around first, didn't I? Yeah. Then I got the bubble plant. Got this one. There's nothing on top of this little hill, is there? Nope. No. Oh. Beautiful area. So, uh, let's go back to the marker here. And from there, go to this ring. Uh, because I. Oh, come on. Yeah. yeah. Why is it that you always have to jump in order to do this? There we go. Got it. Now, there's this stuff. Uh, there are the uh, biggies, but these are not the ones that I wanted. I wanted to go southwest. That's nice. Now, how am I going to defeat them in the future? Because this was a little bit stressful, to be honest. Um, I don't want to use that many uh, regeneration oh, items, yeah. healing items, just so I can, yeah, survive for a little bit. That was definitely a huge pain. <laughs> wow. There we go. In absolute pain. Okay, now I, I think you usually see at least this far, and there's not just a ruin hunter coming out of nowhere. Nah. Okay, that's not it. And you also don't have to uh, trigger the challenge a second time, don't you? Nope. Okay, so the Ruin Hunter will not come back, but the Ruin Guards will. Strange. Because most of the time it's just one Ruin Guard that you have to fight, and not a group of three. A group of three that spin all the time and use AOE targeted missiles. <laughs> oh. There are some enemies that really want to piss you off. Now. Mm, back to this whole dilemma, and what about that? Uh, there's the Sealy and the Animal Mill, yeah. And let's continue with a little, uh, just a little, maybe a, a little bit of exploration towards this uh, 
these two markers that I placed there. Oh, wait, wait, no. Oh. oh, yeah, wait a minute. This is one of those totems. Ah, last time it was raining here. Oh, Jesus, that's beautiful. Wait a minute. Let's do another one of those. Where can you sit? There. Uh huh. This is the area that you want to look at. This is the area that you should look at. Like, this is where you should sit. Hmm. Oh no, the sun is not going down. Too bad. Oh, that is cool. I just want to look at the shadow when it creeps downwards like that. Oh, it gets redder too. Orange, red, pink, purple, dark, whoa. There's a ruin in the sky. Fascinating. Is this where the game started? Because uh, I think you were kind of flying among the stars. There's something flying there too. Do we have any other flying objects except the moon? Which is just... No, you don't. That's quite interesting. Look at this. Complete darkness, ish, except for some, well, smeared stars or galaxies, and then you have this huge band. Cool. This ruin, that is weird. Ah, there we go. There's another flying thing there too. So we have one, two, three <laughs> flying objects. At least, like, this one counted in, but this is more a building instead of a flying ruin altogether. Anyway, I wanted to get... there's a chest there. Why did I not get this chest? Or maybe this chest just, uh, regenerated, I think. But didn't... I? yeah. I did this little riddle here. I think this chest is, uh, did regenerate. Oh, I'm so stupid. <sighs> have to be careful. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, I have to be careful. Mm. A few seconds later, you get a bump at the face. Uh. Look at all of those dishes. Sticky honey roast. Country roast. Oh, this is where you can use all of those carrots for. Decreases stamina depleted. Wait. Decreases stamina depleted by climbing. Depletion. By climbing and sprinting for all party members. Based on so many percent. In co op mode, this effect only applies to your own character, of course. Because there's no way for you to share your dishes with someone. Wait, wait. Oh, I don't have uh, the Yi Jam anymore. Hmm. Do I have a fire? Yeah, this is the only four star, but it does not heal as much. This also kind of heals over time. What about this one? Hmm. This one is nice, but mm, look at this. Compared to that one, that's much simpler. And this is just... It uses special ingredients, and it also uses uh, more ingredients. Like, it's worse on both fronts. Hmm... Nah, uh, too bad you can't filter things out here too. Okay, what do we got there? Uh, let's obtain some of those sugars. Nice. Okay, make more of those. What is this hash brown? Monster hash brown. They look like chicken nuggets to me. Or like cheese thingies. Um... Like grilled cheese. No, 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 no. What just happened? Uh, I'm going to fight something. What am I going to fight? Ah, this one. Huh? 
And I get nothing. Obviously. Yeah. Uh, wait a minute. I had a marker in here that said chest. Okay. That marker is now done. This one says ruin. So... Is this way? Huh. Like, this thing is somewhat connected to this riddle. Like, if you stand on it, or like if you put a heavy object on it, then this gate will stay open. Um, I think what you have to do is put a boulder on it, because the boulder stays there for longer, I believe. Uh, and then you have to start with the, the thing on top, then you have to fall down, and then you have to get this one. Uh, on the other hand, you could just run around if you're fast enough. It also works. But yeah. Uh, where's the bloody ruin? Yeah. The oh. so say no jutsu. Huh. Nice. Uh, of course, we get only uh, common stuff in there. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, what about my level? Wrong level. And there, 7,900 something. Not what I want. Still 7900. Ah, it says ruin. Why does it say ruin? What's so special about this ruin? Uh, why was I so obsessed about this ruin? Like I went from this one over this one over this one. It said ruin. It said ruin. It said ruin. Oh. Uh, nope. I was so obsessed by it because I was, ah, I was walking past it and I did not really have the time to explore it. So there's a little house in front of me, but I think, let's leave this one. There's a house. I will just place a marker there because I have no idea if I will get there or not. Then wasn't I seeing another chest somewhere? I don't know where this was. I think it was either this way or I don't know. Anyway, I actually wanted to just get closer. Ooh, look at that! Another ruin guard. Thankfully, it's only one. It will probably not just be one. There will be more. Oh, there's a Sealy up there too. Uh, Sealy. Uh, this and a chest. Okay. I think I have to split this episode a little bit. Because the exploration will take a little bit longer. Maybe. Quite definitely. Ooh, yep. We're not gonna get, uh, get attacked by this thing. So, uh, before we continue with this little fight, <laughs> send the episode and continue with um, the southern exploration at another time. And then like and subscribe. Ta-ta!